celebrating 50 years. But I don't know how that can be because Eric's not even 50. He must have started the show when he was like two. So anyway, we want to thank you. We're going to try to get through this line as soon as possible. Eric can kind of stop talking so much. Leslie said that's the case. So, so anyway, um, we're going to let each of them tell you hello. Welcome you to the Fall Pickers Market. Thank you for coming out and supporting the Waltons, supporting our vendors this weekend. We have a lot of great vendors. In the corner of this building, we have the Waltons Cafe. Now, how can you get any better than that? So the Walton's Cafe in the corner, there's plenty of food, there's lots of great things. If you have breakfast tickets, that will be located in the pavilion that you just walked through. So we'll have that all set up in the morning for breakfast. There's even a chocolate fountain uh, for breakfast in the morning with biscuits and gravy. We're going to let you go first, Leslie. So Leslie is going to say hello to everyone and we'll kind of just pass this down. Everybody, I'm so glad that you're here. I appreciate it. We love you all. This is so meaningful for us. And we appreciate how far so many of you guys have traveled to be here. Thank you very much. Thank you. She's so nice. <laughs> now there's <She's> me. Not. <laughs> anyway, no, uh, just seeing the lines. Uh, just, it, it really does touch us. And uh, we, we did something back in the back lots of Warner Brothers 50 years ago, and uh, it obviously touched a, a nerve in, in all of you. Um, and it just it, it reinforces what we were doing back then, uh, seeing all of you guys today. So thanks. Be patient. Don't, don't trip anyone. And uh, we'll get to you guys real soon. Thank you. <coughs> Hello. How are you all doing? Uh, my wife Mary and I flew all the way from England to be here. And our arms are really tired. <laughs> it's lovely to see you all. It's great to be here. And I uh, hope you have a wonderful time today. Looking forward to meeting you all. Thank you. <laughs> Down here at this end of the quiet young lady, this is <clears throat> Ben's TV wife, Cindy, and this is Cindy, Ben's wife. <laughs> he only, I guess, knows one name. So Cindy is great, and we thank her for coming and helping this weekend. So. Again, we're gonna to try to get through the lines just as soon as possible. If you have questions about anything, make sure to find us. There's a souvenir booth located inside the Expo Center. Cammy, Rachel, and Mary are located up there, but this line's much quicker, and uh, we wanted to move people down here to get, get through that. If you're interested in the family photo, it has everybody on the family photo. And it also has Judy Norton that played uh, Mary Ellen and David that played Jim Bob on the photo that have already signed those. Those are available for $100. It's a limited edition of that photo. And don't worry, the actors get paid for those signatures too. Um, and it goes to support that. So, so thank them for coming.
became a librarian. Because of that. Um, so we do our normal day to day lives, and occasionally something might bubble up that, that you know, harkens back to 50 years ago um, when we were digging the wall. But most of the time, it's, you know, it's, it's not a daily part. So it's always such an extraordinary like, honor and surprise to see so many folks come out and want to spend time and want to remember the work we did. Um, and then to add on to it, to have this moment to remember two extraordinary people who you know them as their extraordinary characters, right? As Ike Godsey and Ronnie Paragwords. But we were even more lucky because we got to know them as Joe Conley and uh, uh, Ronnie Claire Edwards. So so we, we got to know the real people. Um, and the real people were even more extraordinary and wonderful than the characters. Um, I think... The, we could do like a, a poll, and I could sort of ask you all what you're hoping is going to happen while we're all here together, as opposed to <coughs> being in charge and walking around, which we could do. <laughs> we're very good at that. But I'm going to try to be democratic, right? Um, so how many people, uh, raise your hand if what you're hoping is going to happen here is that we're going to answer questions? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 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 Hands down. Um, how many people are hoping that we're going to just stand up and tell a memory or talk about um, about our memories of working with Ronnie Claire and Jeff.
so much in that audition that they thought we want to keep this girl as a recurring character. So she's not going to do this, she's going to do the recurring character. She'll be the Eichen, the Eichen Corbeth adopted child. So, but what I love, I love being on the set, I love being in the world of adults. Um, and also we were lucky enough to grow up and, and work in a time when kids were pretty much protected. You know, we had to do school, and, and in fact, at one point, only there were, when I first got on the show, there were I think there were two other people who were doing a little bit of school work.